Thanks. Talons, the labyrinth, all punishment for exposing the court. Mm. To think Jacob Kane ever thought we could be on the same side. The labyrinth wasn't just meant to kill us. The court wanted to get in our heads. It might have worked. We'll be okay, Tim. Will we? Batman didn't kill people, but where would he stand on soldiers lining up to be reborn as these monsters? I used to be dead. You think I'm a monster? We have one setback. And this is where you go, Tim? Murder? I get steering him away from killing people, but the labyrinth was more than a setback, Babs. Don't talk about me like I'm not here. You're not Bruce. None of you are. Enough! Gotham practically lined up to kill Batman. Every time Bruce came home, bloodied, near death, I patched him up, just as I now do for you. He was often angry, but he never stooped to their level. And neither will you. Alfred's right. Batman had a code. No matter how tough this gets, we can't betray it. The court is made up of Gotham's founding families. They'll protect their own like only family will. They may be related. They aren't family. Not like we are. The evidence we uncovered against Kane at the hotel is pretty much bulletproof. Then our best course of action isn't war, it's prosecution. I don't think Kane's gonna honor a warrant. He will if we help the cops serve it. The same cops currently gunning for every cape in Gotham? I can think of at least one still on our side. The evidence board has been updated. I was certain the labyrinth had to be some kind of technological marvel. But it was just boxes and props. It's that gas they use. Make you hallucinate your own worst fears. So everything in the labyrinth comes from the target's mind. That's... Terrifying? Yeah. That is some wild shit. 
I knew you'd been in it, but damn, Alfred. <laughs> After my last tour, I chose to come to Gotham. That path led me to a life I'd never imagined. Tech-powered street gangs, secret societies, heroes in capes. <laughs> Sounds so ridiculous when you say it out loud. I thought I was done with war. All I did was trade one for another. The combatants change, the battlefronts shift, but the costs still add up. Yeah. We both have the scars to show for it. Bruce blamed himself for your death, and for the darkness that followed. But even in the worst of times, we saw that you had the potential to emerge as a better man. Some days I barely feel human. Let alone a better man. He believed in you and was proud of how far you'd come. Especially after everything you've been through. She says she needs to speak with you about an arrest warrant. Hopefully this is good news. I think I'll take that. Figured I'd find you here. I mean, not here, here. But somewhere like here. It's nice. Homie. Real homie. I like what you did with the uh, bricks. I bet I could stay up here all night. Sure you can. Dick? Dick! I was an acrobat, you know. <laughs> Fine, you can sit. But you have got to shut up.
Batman left something here. Probably worth getting into. Nightwing identified. Identity verified. Location of cash added to AR device. Log entry BT-79. In a move that surprises even me, I've hired Harley Quinn as a research partner. Or rather, I've hired Dr. Harleen Quinzel. A trained psychiatrist whose work in criminal profiling surpasses even mine. Of course, some of that work is based on her personal experience as a criminal. While this aspect of her history is impossible to overlook, in this instance it's invaluable. It took less convincing than I thought to gain her cooperation. A chance to do good, a small honorarium, and a ride in the Batwing were all the perks she requested. My contacts tell me Harley is comfortably installed at Blackgate. It's genius on her part. No one will suspect her presence, even if she's not actually serving a sentence right now. It puts her in the perfect location to carry out the research I need. It does also put her back into the criminal lifestyle we'd all prefer she left behind, but I will check in on her progress occasionally. I've given her the pattern I'm looking for, She's positioned to comb the records and profile the subjects. They, if they really do exist, won't be looking for Harley. And I'll keep it that way. Not a whispered word is said. You're the number one water cooler topic down at the precinct. Keep up the good work. Hey, Montoya. How's the file and Colonel Voice going? I've got enough evidence to lock Kane up for years. It's the warrant that's the problem. Isn't it always? I've been to see every judge I know, and no one will sign it. They're scared. I'm not surprised. Even without the court connection, Kane has a lot of power. And weapons. Have you tried Judge Moreno? She's put away a bunch of Gotham elites. Doesn't seem to care who she pisses off. Elena was one of the first names on my list. But I guess things got bad over that whole Chelsea Tunnel case. She's gone into hiding. A judge doesn't just disappear, even in this city. I'll ask around, see if anyone's got a direction to point me. Get that warrant signed, and you know I'll serve it. Nice job out there. Judge Elena Moreno, tell me where she is. Look, we're not crazy enough to cross the people who want Moreno dead. But the regulators, they've been bragging about a big protection job. Appreciate the tip. Oh. <laughs> Belfry, the mob says they stayed as far away from Moreno as they could. They think she cut a deal with the regulators, though. Copy that. Let's find her. about Judge Elena Moreno. I don't know, but I know we just sold some top-end security equipment. Maybe it was for her. Thank you. <laughs> Belfry, regulators sold security tech to the freaks. Said they don't know anything about Moreno. 
The freaks wouldn't do that unless they had a reason. I wonder if it's related to Moreno. I got nothing to do with this. <laughs> Pop quiz, freak. Judge Elena Moreno is missing. Do you know where she is? Oh, yeah. I heard that all we gotta do is keep her safe from those guys in the bird masks. Easy. Got it. <laughs> Belfry, I've got updates. Moreno cut a deal with the freaks for protection. I'm en route to her location. Can't say I'm surprised. Stay alert out there.